In this video, I'm going to do a Speechalo review for you. So this is the main screen of Speechalo. There are three versions to Speechalo. You've, you've got the Speechalo main version, then you've got the pro version, which will give you access to over 100 more uh, premium voices, um, gives you uh, dialogue type voiceovers, four times longer voiceover, so it'll give you 20,000 characters instead of five. It gives you 40 background music module. It gives you commercial license so you can sell them. And then it gives you a bonus tutorial training uh, voiceover cash machine, how you can sell them and make money from them. Uh, depending on what you are using them for, you may not need the pro version, but I do, I will say the pro version voices do sound better than the, um, the front end version. And then there's a worldwide version that you can get as well, and the worldwide version is, um, you can translate with that. So here are, uh, this is the main screen here, and th this up here is just your stats, but here is where you can put in your uh, text, the text that you want to be converted into speech. And then over here in the settings is where you get to see um, what languages there are. There are a lot of languages in here that you can that you can select from. And then you will just put your text here in that native language. And then it will. Uh, it, they have accents and everything else. It's really really cool. I just do want to show you real quick here. I'll go to the sales page and I'm going to scroll down a little bit and I'm going to show you here that you can go to the sales page if you click on the the link down below in the video in the description box and you will get to demo some of these and all you have to do is just click on them so let me click on one here and this is a kid one hello I'm Owen and I'm one of the kid voices from Speechalo okay that's one of them and then you can go and, and uh, uh, just click on each one of these and you can demo them straight from the sales page but I'm going to show you a few of them uh, right here so you would just put in your text. So what I've done was I've gone ahead and I've copied a, a story, Little Red Riding Hood. And I'm going to paste that in here. And it's just a, a nursery rhyme. So um, we're going to start with English. And you can select the AI voice or the standards. Uh, if you select the standard, it's going to give you more options such as add breathing. You can emphasize words. You can adjust your speech and you can add pauses in it. If you select the AI voice, you will have less options, but the AI voice does sound a lot better than the standard voice. The standard voices do sound more robotic than the AI voices though, so I always keep with the AI voices. You can go with different tones, normal tone, friendly tone, and serious tone. Now I found that when you change the tones, it normally changes the speed of the, te of the, the voice. So. Um, play around with it, see which one works best for you. For me, normal tone works best for me, I think. So I'm just going to select the first one. It's Billy Mail. And I can preview it. And if I click preview, it's going to allow me to preview it. It's going to take it a second or two. Once upon a time, there lived a little country girl, the prettiest creature who was. This is a preview. It only text. takes the first Which 100 voices. characters, and it gives you kind of preview of what it's going to sound like. So then, say we like it, we're going to go ahead and click Generate. And then it says, for better sounding voiceovers, we recommend that you split the text into multiple parts. Please watch the video below to understand why. I'm not going to do that right now. I think they sound just fine doing it without doing that. I'll click OK. No, actually. I wanted to click the red button. Okay, we're blasting your text to voice. Okay, so the voiceover has been created. As you can see, it doesn't take long. And let me refresh it. Okay, there it is. Okay, so. Okay, so um, there it is, and it gives me um, information. So it, it gives it a unique ID. It tells me what language it is, what voice I used, and the text. So I can play it from here. 
what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste that here and I can take this and I can move it down if I want and then I can play once upon a time there lived a little country girl the prettiest creature who was ever seen her mother had a little red riding hood made for her everybody called her little red riding hood okay so that one's not too bad um, we're going to go ahead and do the kid one. This is one of my favorite ones. And I'm going to generate. And Owen Kid is uh, one of the best ones, in my opinion. And I really like the way this one sounds. So the voiceover's been created. Okay, so let me play this one for you. Once upon a time, there lived a little country girl, the prettiest creature who was ever seen. Her mother had a little red riding hood made for her. Everybody called her little red riding hood. One day her mother said to her, go my dear, and see how your grandmother is doing. Okay, so that one's one of the best ones that I've found. And if you like what you, what you hear here, you can download it. And you wanna add background music and you can select yes to add or no to download. I think this is a, yeah, that's a pro. So you have to have the pro to do that. So we're going to go ahead and click download and just I'll just click never ask me again and just click no and then there it is and then that'll bring it up in whatever Once you upon use. Once a time there lived a little country girl, the prettiest creature so that's ever seen. Now been, that's now been downloaded. Red riding hood made for her. Every so that's now been downloaded to my computer and it's been downloaded wherever your downloads go from your from your uh, web browser. Okay, so let me uh, let me just do a couple more here. Let me put my text back in here. This is Rosie. Now, what I can do is I can click I can click preview. Hi, I'm Rosie. I am a native English speaker. And you, that'll you can preview. This is the one we just heard. Hi, I'm Owen. I am a native English speaker. Um. These are the pros. You can preview the pros before you buy them. So this is Hi, a pro. I'm Summer. I am a native English speaker. This is one of the better Hi. ones. Hi. My name is Grace. I am a native English speaker. Um, I'm going to go to the one of the, if you like people with accents here, to use people with accents, I can, you can go to, um, Australian, the Australian accent. I don't know where it's at. Let me find it. English, British, English, Welsh, Ireland. There was an Australian in here somewhere. Let me see if I can find it. There it is, right over it. Okay, so this one's a really good one. I'm gonna click this one. Oh, did the standard version. Okay, so we need to click the AI. We'll generate. We'll generate. Blasting text to voice. Okay, and Let's go ahead and click it. This is the best one. Once upon found. a time, there lived a little country girl, the prettiest creature who was ever seen. Her mother had a little red riding hood made for her. Everybody called her little red riding hood. Okay, that's one of the better ones. And the uh, British one is another good one. Um, the only one that you get here, well, you get Beatrix too. But Arthur is a really good one. I'm going to generate Arthur here. And you can see that Arthur, let me see, let me do the AI voice one. And you'll see that Arthur is a really good one. British English Arthur. Okay. Once upon a time there lived a little country girl, the prettiest creature who was ever seen. Her mother had a little red riding hood made for her. Everybody called her Little Red Riding Hood. 
Okay, so that's a really good one as well. So um, you can see there's also training here. You can go to training and uh, here are the, uh, the training using campaigns and merging them. You can say if you want to do more than 5,000 characters, you can go, let me go back to my voice generator and I'll show you. You can take them and you can, um, if you don't have the pro and you want to do more than 5,000 characters, you can do 5,000 characters in one file and then the rest in another file. And then you, what you would do is you would select which ones you want to merge and then you would merge them and you can merge files and then it will merge both audio files and then you would just put a name in here and I'll just put merged and it'll merge the two files together for you and those two files have been merged and I believe that's all I wanted to show you um, this is the uh, the background music uh, you can do import YouTube captions but you need the worldwide option to do that um, you can do translate you need the worldwide option to do that um, but that's it um, I did uh, show you a few uh, uh, voices that you can do with uh, speech hello the, this is a really good quality uh, voice uh, voice text-to-speech voice program um, I use it a lot I use it on my YouTube videos on different YouTube channels and um, you really really with most of these you really can't tell that they are AI voices you really can't so um, in order, if you want to go ahead and pick this up today go ahead and click the link down below in the description box that'll take you to this page right here um, you can go ahead and uh, demo them down below if you want and um, go ahead and get the pro version if you like the pro version now the pro version is uh, forty seven dollars but do keep in mind that the pro version is forty seven dollars for every three months so you will be rebuilt forty seven dollars for every three months that's the only way that you can get a commercial license with speech low is if you get the pro version so thank you for watching my speech low demo today and thank you uh, for watching. If you want to uh, leave a like below, leave a like below if you like this video. Um, please subscribe to the channel as well. You'll see more videos like this as well. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.